Prior to discussing the announcement, it is essential to comprehend what particle accelerators are. The Big CERN's Hadron Collider LHC, which is a 17-meter-long superconducting magnet ring, is the largest and most powerful particle accelerator. It symbolizes the highest level of human scientific accomplishments. So powerful, in fact, that it can recreate the very conditions at the beginning of the universe. But could this apparatus be used to unlock the key to the universe's secrets? Perhaps to something much more unsettling. Established in 1954, CERN is one of the most reputable research institutions. With 23 member nations and thousands of scientists, it serves as a hub for collaboration and its flagship innovation is the LHC. However, is only one component of an extensive system of accelerators and experiments. Envision a racetrack not for cars, but for subatomic particles racing against the clock in space itself. The LHC accelerates protons to nearly the speed of light, sending them into collisions that mimic the energy of the universe at the time of the Big Bang. These collisions create temperatures a million times hotter than the core of the sun. Thousands of magnets facilitate the proton's journey, while complex cooling systems maintain the magnets at temperatures below freezing. The LHC's beams are caused to collide in four different areas around the accelerator ring, corresponding to the positions of four particle detectors, LHCB, ATLAS, CMS, and ALICE. Each serves a unique goal in investigating various aspects of particle physics. Together, they act as colossal cameras, capturing snapshots of these collisions. Scientists then sift through the debris, looking for signs of the elusive Higgs boson also, known as the God particle and other phenomena that offer clues to the fundamental building blocks of the universe. By studying the microcosm, we gain insights into the larger world. Yet with each new answer comes another question, and every discovery presents new obstacles. The LHC is not just a scientific instrument. It exemplifies human curiosity, innovation, and our unwavering desire to understand the essential forces that still shape our universe. However, in pushing the boundaries of what we know, we must also consider the moral and existential concerns that arise including the dangers of examining the unknown, which could accidentally unlock forces we cannot control in the hallowed. Halls of CERN, where the boundaries of human comprehension are constantly pushed. A revelation has emerged, one that sends a shiver down the spine of even the most seasoned scientists. Brian Cox, a former CERN researcher and authority in the world of particle physics, recently made an announcement that had been lost to history. His words were both fascinating and terrifying, resonating with haunting clarity. The goal of the Large Hadron Collider at CERN is to recreate a miniature Big Bang Yes. It's a miniature version of the very event that led to our universe. The physicist went on to enumerate the ramifications of this objective, highlighting the remarkable potential of the LHC, the capacity to unlock the Higgs boson secrets and investigate a mysterious substance known as dark matter, significant component of the universe itself. Imagine holding in your hands the power to conjure the universe's very essence. It's a tempting possibility, but the miniature Big Bang is fraught with danger. At the LHC, such conditions are not only theoretical, they are observable reality. The temperatures, pressures, and raw energy mimic those at the dawn of time. When existence itself was born, with such power comes responsibility. But what if something went wrong? In fact, something terribly did go wrong in a different place and time. In 1978, Anatoly Bogorsky, a Russian physicist, suffered an incident that would forever alter the course of his life. While working on the U-70 synchrotron at the Institute for High Energy Physics in Protino, Russia, an error caused his head to accidentally cross the path of a proton beam a forceful stream of particles beyond comprehension. The beam entered through the back of his head and exited through his nose. But Gorsky's experience was unlike any other. He saw a flash brighter than a thousand suns, 
yet felt no pain. The beam's path left a trail of destruction burning through. Tissue and bone yet, astonishingly, he remained conscious and even walked to the clinic for treatment. The aftermath was both fascinating and horrifying. Localized tissue death, hearing loss in one ear, and partial facial paralysis. And yet, Bogorsky's intellectual capabilities remained intact, and he continued his scientific career. His story stands as both a personal tragedy and a cautionary example of the immense power and potential danger of particle accelerators. The risks are not to be underestimated. Among the most troubling concerns about LHC experiments is the possibility, however, remote of creating a miniature black hole. A. Black hole is a region of space-time with such strong gravity that not even light can escape. They are cosmic scavengers, capable of consuming stars and remain among the most mysterious entities in the universe. The idea that the LHC could create even a microscopic black hole is shocking to both the public and experts alike. Such a black hole could, in theory, expand uncontrollably swallowing the Earth from within. CERN scientists insist that any black hole created would be unstable and disappear almost immediately. Yet the mere possibility stirs both fear and awe at the power we wield that to understand how the LHC might form a black hole. We must look at the mechanics of particle accelerators. When protons are smashed together near light speed, the energy released is so immense that it can distort space-time itself. Imagine a trampoline stretched tight, then having a heavy weight placed on IFT fabric dips, creating a depression. If the depression is deep enough, anything nearby would be drawn in. This crude analogy mirrors what could theoretically happen in the LHC, in the strange world of quantum physics. Some theories propose that additional dimensions may be hidden within our universe. If they exist, LHC collisions could create a gravitational funnel. Forming a microscopic black hole, this possibility drew the attention of the late Stephen Hawking who warned that the Higgs boson might become unstable at very high energy levels. Such instability, he theorized, could lead to catastrophic vacuum decay, a cosmic event that could threaten not only Earth, but the entire universe. Similarly, the renowned British cosmologist Sir Martin Rees expressed deep concern in his book on humanity's future, he explored the potential dangers of high-energy particle experiments, including those at CERN. His warnings were tinged with existential dread. In a worst-case scenario, a failed experiment could trigger vacuum instability, causing a phase transition that ripples through the very fabric of space, mingulfing the universe itself. Rees assigned these catastrophic outcomes a low probability but argued that even a minuscule chance should give us pause, given the stakes. The margin for error is almost non-existent. CERN scientists, including Brian Cox, have calculated the odds, run simulations, and examined the theories, concluding that the LHC is safe. Cox acknowledged public fears, but stressed that strict safety. Measures, extensive procedures, and thorough checks ensure that LHC operations are conducted with utmost care. The energies involved, he reassured, are well within those naturally encountered by Earth, and the chances of creating a stable black hole are extremely low. Even if one were created, it would be so tiny and unstable that it would vanish in a burst of energy a phenomenon predicted by Hawking, known as Hawking radiation. Some speculate even further that LHC experiments could open a portal to another universe or dimension. While largely dismissed by the scientific community, the idea has captured the imagination of many. The thoughts of many people have evolved into a matter that fascinates, scares, and even fuels folklore describing the world beyond ours. Could we inadvertently unleash forces or entities that we are unable to comprehend? The concept of opening. A door to hell has even generated sensation in a variety of media, contributing to the blaze of curiosity. I'm unsure how this idea came to be and what it means in the context of scientific research. Parallel dimensions are not new in physics. 
String theory, a potential candidate for a single theory of everything, posits that there may be more than the usual three dimensions of space, with time as a fourth. Additional dimensions could be compactified or concealed from view, but in theory, they might be accessed or even exposed under extreme circumstances. Imagine the LHC as a key to the cosmos. Releasing locks on doors closed since the beginning of time. When proton collisions at unimaginable energies are achieved on Earth, they could, in theory, reveal undiscovered dimensions or construct bizarre new phenomena. In this sense, the LHC transforms into a vehicle for humanity's curiosity. Pushing the boundaries of what we know and of what we didn't even know to ask as we begin this journey of discovery. One thing is certain, the effects of our actions will be extensive. The goal of knowledge is always accompanied by both wonder and risk. While scientists strive to unravel the deepest mysteries of existence, we must also remember that with great authority comes a great deal of responsibility. As the pursuit of knowledge through the LHC continues, the stakes grow ever higher. The more we delve into the mysteries of the universe, the more we come face to face with the unknown. And with that unknown comes a profound obligation. Science has always been driven by the quest for understanding, a desire to learn the truths of existence. To reveal the fundamental components that make up everything we see, feel, and experience. However, each revelation frequently results in more complex questions and new unknowns that demand investigation. The LHC has enormous potential, but it is not just a machine that accelerates particles. It serves as a link to nature's deepest mysteries, providing a doorway into the heart of the universe. The findings already produced, such as the 2012 confirmation of the Higgs boson, are significant. They confirm the existence of particles predicted decades before, strengthening the conventional theory of particle physics. Yet the unexplored frontiers are even more exciting. The LHC has the potential to shed light on dark matter, the mysterious substance that makes up most of the universe's mass yet remains undetectable by conventional means. It may even offer the key to understanding dark energy, the mysterious force accelerating the expansion of the universe. But as researchers push the boundaries of knowledge, they must also recognize the limits of their understanding, the potential of the LHC for discovery is unparalleled, but each experiment carries the risk of unintended consequences. In a field so vast and complex, there are always risks of outcomes that may not go as planned. Despite strict safety protocols and decades of preparation, there is always a possibility of unforeseen events, events that could challenge not only our understanding of physics, but our very existence. For all its potential dangers, however, the LHC is also a demonstration of human inventiveness and determination. Its enormous size and ambitious goals reflect humanity's desire to push beyond the known. Universe into space's darkest corners. It serves as a reminder that the pursuit of knowledge, while fraught with uncertainty, has driven human progress for centuries. It is that curiosity, that relentless pursuit of truth, that has brought us to this point on the cusp of some of the most significant developments in human history. As the LHC's operations continue, the world watches closely. It is not only researchers who are intrigued, people from all walks of life are drawn to its potential to unravel the universe's mysteries. Public interest sparks debates, hopes, and even fears. Some view the LHC as a tool that could lead us to a greater understanding of the cosmos and our place within it. Others approach it with trepidation, wary of the potential dangers that such powerful experiments might entail. As with all major research projects, the LHC represents a delicate balance, a place where ambition meets caution. It is a powerful instrument that opens up new realms of knowledge, yet demands careful consideration of the consequences. CERN scientists are acutely aware of these dangers and work with utmost diligence, though the nature of their work forces them to accept that science offers no guarantees, only possibilities, probabilities, and a permanent search for understanding. In the end, the LHC will continue to be a beacon of exploration.
is more than just a machine. It is a representation of humanity's unwavering search for truth. But as we explore the vast unknown, we must remember with each new discovery. We may also uncover new obstacles, new responsibilities, new uncertainties. The acquisition of knowledge is a journey, one fraught with both wonder and risk. And now, as we stand on the threshold of a new era of discovery, we must ask ourselves, are we prepared for what we might find? What lies ahead in the future of particle physics? The LHC's experiments are as enigmatic as the questions they seek to answer. One thing is certain, the findings from this cutting-edge research will shape our understanding of the universe for generations to come. As it continues its work, the LHC is not merely a scientific experiment, it is a testament to human curiosity. Resilience and the determination to uncover the unknown, regardless of the outcomes. The journey itself will be forever woven into the fabric of human knowledge.